Since my injury, I've come to realize that life is a precious gift. It's a gift. It's a gift that we open up early in the morning and things unfold. And I tell you, we are not promised tomorrow. 
and I'm here to hopefully give you enough knowledge so you can see many, many, many tomorrows. Little did I know that two months after my high school graduation, my life turned upside down when I had borrowed a friend's motorcycle. How many of you here have not always listened to your mom and dad? Yes. But uh, why is it important to listen to mom and dad? Yes? Because they can see, keep you really safe. Because they can keep you safe. <laughs> T-shirt design that you are that have that you have on your safety kit, I drew that with my oh. mouth. Wow. Oh. And it took me, it took me. You can do it. You can do it. Yes, the dolphin. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> we came out today to uh, teach you guys a few things. We've got actually four different activities going on. So yellow team, you're going to start out with wacky first aid. And we're gonna set up a triage station. There's a whole pile of different injuries that um, Carrie's gonna talk to you about how to prevent, um, what if you had the injury, how you would treat it, and um, what to do um, to get help. Don't stare at him, that's impolite. <laughs> He's rather 
fly a kite and get it into a power line. Oh, that's fast. We're basically here today to talk to you about what the canines do and demonstrate some of our abilities. Andrea Hunt and I'd like to welcome you to our 2013 City of Blaine Safety Camp Award Ceremony. I am a crime prevention specialist with the Blaine Police Department and part of my role with the Police Department is to work with the elementary aged kids in our community and to teach them how to be safe. And with that, Safety Camp is a big focus of our time in the summer months. Why do we do this program? Unintentional injury is the leading cause of death for kids birth to age 14. 
And our goal in Safety Camp is to give these kids some really valuable messages that they can use now and also as they become young adults and they become the leaders within our community also. The most important number that I would like to draw your attention to are some numbers about your children that are here right now. A sad fact over the 17 years that we have done this camp, 17 years, is that the number one thing that continues to kill our kids, and it's always at the top of this list, is car crashes. It's always the number one thing. And we want to focus a little bit on that because we want to prevent that from happening. Of the 156 kids that attended camp, only 31 of them meet the recommendations and regulations to be out of a booster seat. So without further delay, I'd like to bring our safety campers up on stage. Uh, next one is Madison Barasa. Okay. 